Southern States Wrestling brings the Winter Heat Wave to the Armed Forces Reserve Center Armory, 399 Highway 11W in Mount Carmel, Tennessee, just one mile west of Kingsport. Saturday, January 27th, bell time, 7.30 p.m. In the main event, it's all on the line. Wayne Atkins' last shot at Southern States Heavyweight Champion Lord Murphy Costigan. And Costigan is going for revenge. If Atkins loses, he will not get another shot at the Southern States Heavyweight title as long as Costigan is champion. If Costigan loses, he is fired from Southern States Wrestling. Return match, Battle of the Brutes. This time it's for the Southern States Legacy title. Brand new champion Lawrence defends against the wild man, Wild Bill. The exciting CJ Knight will test his skills against the returning Mike Mann. The faction Jeff Baker and Jeff Conley will be in tag team action. All of this and much more. Tickets on sale at 6.30 p.m. Don't you dare miss it. It's the Southern States Wrestling Winter Heat Wave. Saturday, January 27th, 7.30 p.m. at the Armory in Mount Carmel. Be there! Tonight, Saturday, January 27th is the night. Winter heat wave, an end of a rival, the closing of a chapter. Tonight, you will either see Wayne Atkins win the Southern States Heavyweight Championship for a third time, becoming one of the only a few men that have done that. Or you will see his last shot at the title as long as Costigan is the champion. If Murphy Costigan loses tonight, he's fired. Let's take a look at how this happened and hear from the champion. Murphy Costigan. No, 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 no. you got to stay here for this. January 27th, Southern States Heavyweight Championship is on the line. Plus, if you lose the title that evening, you're gone from SSW. Mr. Taylor Presenter. <laughs> Let me tell you something right now. For how you're speaking to me and how you're acting, you're looking. I don't even put your eye on Now, what happened today was egregious. It was egregious. It was multiple people on one. They, they robbed me. They robbed me. Now they want to get rid of me. You want to treat me unfairly? Well, Wayne Adkins, tonight you may have got the upper hand, but it does not stay the same, lad. It's going to change on the 27th. Hey, uh, I'd just like to point out that everything was fair. Nothing was treated unfair. Two referees. He had guys run in the ring. The referees took care of them. I had to take care of one of them. He lost the match. He has made all these stipulations. Well, here's the stipulation. That belt up against Wayne Atkins, you lose it. You're fired. You're gone. Just like Daniel Richards, I've already busted you guys up. Now I'm ready to get rid of you. Ah! All right, wrestling fans, Joe Wheeler here with Wade Atkins. And Wade, you won the hair versus hair match. You defeated Lord Murphy Costigan, and he got his head shaved, but it's not over. January the 27th, the title is on the line. And if he loses this time, not only does he lose the title, but he also has to leave Southern States Wrestling. I mean... Mr. Wheeler, can you believe that it could get any better than Murphy being bald than what it's about to be January the 27th? I'm going to take his championship, and then, Mr. Wheeler, me and you, we ain't got to look at him no more. We ain't got to hear him coming on here, running his mouth, pulling guys out of the woodwork to try to beat me up, try to beat my friends up, nothing. He's done. He's gone. So I took his hair. We're going to take his championship. And then he can take his bags and go home, and we ain't got to look at him no more. I love it, Joe Wheeler. It sounds like a good time to me. January 27th, I'm ready, Joe. You ready? Absolutely. January 27th, fans, you don't want to miss it. Let's see if Wade Atkins can get this done. There's been some speculation 
about the state of Murphy Costigan after my hair versus hair match with Wayne Atkins at Christmas Star Wars on December the 30th. So for those who were not there, the deck was fully stacked against me, the referees against me, Bo James against me, Wayne Atkins, and they were all able to team together and overcome me and shave my head in the ring. But don't worry about that, because as you can see, my hair, it is back, and I must say, it is looking better than ever, courtesy of the Dr. Schnavitz Miracle Hair Growth Treatments. But there was also another unfortunate side effect of this match. You can go back and watch the footage, and you will see Wayne Atkins repeatedly kick, hit, punch my left ear, causing inner ear damage. Now, what the extent of that damage is... I don't know. I'm meeting with doctors, with professionals to determine if there will be any long-term effects. So for the time being and for the foreseeable future, anytime I compete inside of a wrestling ring, I will be wearing this protective headgear to protect my left ear and to make sure that I don't suffer any permanent hearing loss. But moving on to January the 27th. Wayne Atkins, you get the final opportunity for the Southern States Wrestling Heavyweight title. And of course, to stock the deck against me further, Bo James implemented another stipulation that if I lose, I am fired from Southern States Wrestling. So for you lot that think that that's a possibility, just put that out of your wee little minds right now. Because I'm not going anywhere. Wayne Atkins, I'm going to beat you like I have before, and this will be the final time you ever challenge me for the Southern States Wrestling Heavyweight title because it's in the contract. If you lose, that's it. No more opportunities. And you're going to lose on January the 27th, mate. I guarantee that. So be sure to come out January the 27th, Armed Forces Reserve Center in Mount Carmel, Tennessee, to see Wayne Atkins wrestle Murphy Costigan for the final time for the Southern States Wrestling Heavyweight title. Hello, I'm Ken Dapper and our Dalton Direct Carpets. Thank you, our loyal customers, for keeping us in business for over 46 years. We couldn't do it without your support. We offer affordable prices on all of our carpet, waterproof flooring, vinyl, and wood flooring. We are featuring heavy plush carpet on sale at $1.69 per square foot, and I have 24 colors in stock for immediate installation. Please come by during our sale and let our salespeople assist you on getting the right floor in the right room at the right price. That's Dalton Direct Carpets, Kingsport. Southern States Wrestling brings the winter heat wave to the Armed Forces Reserve Center Armory, 399 Highway 11W in Mount Carmel, Tennessee, just one mile west of Kingsport. Saturday, January 27th, bell time 7.30 p.m. In the main event, it's all on the line. Wayne Atkins' last shot at Southern States Heavyweight Champion Lord Murphy Costigan. And Costigan is going for revenge. If Atkins loses, he will not get another shot at the Southern States heavyweight title as long as Costigan is champion. If Costigan loses, he is fired from Southern States Wrestling. Return match, Battle of the Brutes. This time it's for the Southern States legacy title. Brand new champion Lawrence defends against the wild man, Wild Bill. The exciting CJ Knight will test his skills against the returning Mike Mann. The faction, Jeff Baker and Jeff Conley, will be in tag team action. All of this and much more. Tickets on sale at 6.30 p.m. Don't you dare miss it. It's the Southern States Wrestling Winter Heat Wave, Saturday, January 27th, 7.30 p.m. at the Armory in Mount Carmel. Be there. Welcome back. Southern States Wrestling Winter Heat Wave tonight at the Armed Forces Reserve Center Armory 399 Highway 11W Mount Carmel, Tennessee return match. Battle of the Brutes. Let's take a look at what has went down so far between Lawrence and Wild Bill. Joe Wheeler here with Wild Bill and Wild Bill you've got a huge matchup against Lawrence here and what are your intentions here in Southern States Wrestling? I've come to hurt people and I'm starting with you, Mr. Lawrence. Be a little bit dazed out of it. Holy cow! The power of Lawrence on display. That was impressive. And for a cover, but I don't think he's going to get him on that one. No, not at all. But, I mean, that speaks volumes 
to the upper body strength of Lawrence and what he can deliver in this ring. Yeah, because, I mean, I didn't get the quite the weight on Wild Bill, but I guarantee you he's around that 300-pound mark as he is a large man. And Lawrence now opening up on him as he's realized he's got a fight here. This Wild Bill may be making his debut in Southern States Wrestling, but I don't think this man is new to wrestling. No, I'm getting vibes that he talks about from being way out west. Maybe he's had a match or two out west that you or I are not aware of because he does have some skill that we've seen in this match so far. Absolutely. Bill's back up. And Lawrence moving right back in with that eye rake as uh, that Wild Bill is wearing a mask. But I guarantee you those fingers are still sneaking in those eye holes and, and causing damage. Snap mares this man right back out. And Lawrence going to work on him with that neck vice as he's got him wrenched back here. Yeah, that'll work on the top couple vertebrae right near the skull. As we see here, Wild Bill getting up to one knee. Fans getting behind him, gets to another. But Wild Bill taken back down just like that by Lawrence. Lawrence now got Bill under control, putting the boots to him here. As uh, he Lawrence knows he's got this man down, he better take advantage and do whatever he can. Step over toe hold here. And now wrenching in on that leg, and look at how bad that leg is bent back as Lawrence is applying a ton of pressure. Yeah, that'll do some damage to ligaments. If it goes the wrong way, you could even break the ankle a little bit or roll it, which makes it difficult to put weight on your leg. And Lawrence now complete dominance here at this point as Wild Bill tries to catch his breath. Lawrence bringing Bill up. Got to think about this strategy, putting him in the corner though, Joe Wheeler. He's got him pinned up in that corner, laying the shoulder blocks to him. Lawrence has got a plan here. He better execute it quickly because he's giving Bill time to rest. And there it cost him right there. Bill was able to step out of the way. Oh, big double ax handle blow. And a second double ax handle. Almost like a heart punch away. He's hitting him with those right in the chest. And they are leveling big Lawrence. Bill might be able to put Lawrence away here in a minute. Yeah, all that weight and force coming down. Oh, my. What a suplex on a wild Bill. Snap suplex perfectly executed. And you talk about a load, right? Both these guys now. Bill's trying to make his way back up to a vertical base. He has done so. And the fans are thoroughly supporting wild Bill as he looks like he's going to the top rope here, Jonathan. Oh, that's a lot of weight coming down on you if Wild Bill nails it. And, oh! The head went straight into the canvas on that one. And Lawrence coming off with a big splash of his own. We've seen this before, and he got him right there as Lawrence had to fight for it, but he got that victory. Over there. Trey and CJ. Oh. Hi. Wait, well, Trey's gone. It is, they're dropping like flies in there. Lawrence trying to get the other one out. Daniel. And it'll be the battle of the big men now. January the 27th, we will return to Mount Carmel, Tennessee. And the winner will be presented with the new legacy television title. And it's going to be between one of these guys. And oh my, it looks like Lawrence is going to take it home. Maybe. Wow, Bill. Oh my! Wait a minute, both men on the outside have gone over the top rope. Wild Bill, oh, those feet still are up there. Both feet have to touch the floor here. So whoever hits that floor first. And they're fighting away on the outside as if their life depended on it. What a battle between these two men. Going back and forth, oh, I reckon. There we go, Lawrence wins it. Lawrence wins it. Lawrence. Southern States Wrestling brings the winter heat wave to the Armed Forces Reserve Center Armory, 399 Highway 11W in Mount Carmel, Tennessee, just one mile west of Kingsport. Saturday, January 27th, bell time, 7.30 p.m. In the main event, it's all on the line. Wayne Atkins' last shot at Southern States Heavyweight Champion, Lord Murphy Costigan. 
and Costigan is going for revenge. If Atkins loses, he will not get another shot at the Southern States heavyweight title as long as Costigan is champion. If Costigan loses, he is fired from Southern States Wrestling. Return match, Battle of the Brutes. This time it's for the Southern States Legacy title. Brand new champion Lawrence defends against the wild man, Wild Bill. The exciting CJ Knight will test his skills against the returning Mike Mann. The faction, Jeff Baker and Jeff Conley will be in tag team action. All of this and much more. Tickets on sale at 6.30 p.m. Don't you dare miss it. It's the Southern States Wrestling Winter Heat Wave. Saturday, January 27th, 7.30 p.m. at the Armory in Mount Carmel. Be there. Hi, I'm Ken Daffron, owner of Dalton Direct Carpets in Kingsport, Tennessee. Hello, I'm Ken Daffron, owner of Dalton Direct Carpets, starting our 21st year. Hello, I'm Ken Daffron, owner of Dalton Direct Carpets. Hello, I'm Ken Daffron, owner of Dalton Direct Carpets. Please come by and help us celebrate our 40th anniversary. Hello, I'm Ken Daffron, owner of Dalton Direct Carpets. I've changed a lot over 46 years. Who hasn't? Dalton Direct Carpets hasn't changed. During our sale going on now, we have the best prices on carpet, waterproof flooring, vinyl, and wood flooring in the Tri-Cities area. That's Dalton Direct Carpets in Kingsport. We hope that you are making plans to be with us tonight at the Armed Forces Reserve Center Armory, 399 Highway 11 W, Mount Carmel, Tennessee. Doors open and tickets go on sale at 6.30 p.m. Bell time is 7.30 p.m. The only way to see all of the action is you have to be there live and in person. We'll see you ringside tonight and right back here with a brand new episode of Legacy next week.